Hi guys, what's up? It's Rin with another video. So today we're going to be um, adding all of my new photo cards from my January K-pop haul into my binders. So if you've watched my previous videos, maybe you'll notice there's a new binder added to the <laughs> binders. A third binder, which it's just because this binder has become too full. Like, it's massive. So I need to separate my Jungkook collection with my BTS collection. We will be doing that in this binder as well as adding some other K-pop group uh, photo cards into the this binder. Uh, disclaimer, my nails are half done, literally. Uh, I did this side already and I work was really breezy so I wasn't able to do this side. Um, I do my own nails usually. So sorry about that if that irks you throughout this video. I'm so sorry. Like just i'll try to only use my left hand okay sounds I'm good to start with this binder and these are everything that i have to add in so it's like two drawer or quite a bit of stuff um that we have to add in today okay so this is everything i have to add to this binder let's just begin so i'll start with this eight lisa photo card so I already have um, two of each of these sets, the puzzle pieces for every member. Um, and so let me add in a spot for Lisa's new one. So I get a lot of questions about this binder and this binder is from Amazon. Um, you can also order it for like really, really cheap, like $4 or less even. Um, on AliExpress if you're willing to wait a month to get it just look for a transparent A5 binder and you'll be able to find this this is the A5 version it does come in different sizes um, but you don't want to get those because those will be too small for you and then the sleeves all for this binder are sleeves that I personally make this was a two pocket sleeve binder I need two pocket sleeve kind of like this one and then I sewed a line in the middle I made a whole video about it a long time ago, but I never uploaded it because it was long. <laughs> the video was long and yeah, at that time I, I wasn't, it was like my first binder. It was when I was still putting BTS into that binder. So yeah, I made these slots and they fit perfectly with the puzzle pieces. If you guys would like me to make a video showing you how to do them like specifically, specifically and more detailed a um, way to how to make all of the slots that are in this binder I would be happy to do that just leave a comment and let me know I would be more than happy to do that so that's Lisa's right there I only need one more version which I would be willing to buy if you have it and you're willing to sell it to me since a lot of you guys do ask where I get my four pocket sleeves I'll show you guys how or where I get them so actually I make them myself from nine pocket sleeves like this um, and all of these were pre-made so if you've seen my other putting in my photo card videos you've seen that I've already had them made but I'm out now so I have to make a new one so I can add in my new photo cards. The bottom of this section there's like a little line that you can cut through making sure you're not cutting through like the actual stop of where the where the sleeve is like don't cut through that obviously so cut through all the way and then you can save this to make um sleeves for your trades and things like that so usually these three i'll cut and make separate one pocket sleeve and then you'll see that this one has a line through it you want to put your scissors right in the middle so that you're not cutting through the actual perforation to where there's a hole. And then you'll have two perfect one pocket sleeves as well. As long as, long as you cut perfectly, then there's going to be no hole. And this will work. So usually I'll cut this. Just so you guys know what I do with. These two are perfect one pocket sleeves for trades. So you can put a photo card into it like that and then send it out in a top loader and that's a trade. This is how you get the four pocket sleeves and I usually do the top four corners 
And what we'll do is we'll take one of these old four pocket sleeves. Like this. And we make punches. So if it's your first time making a four pocket sleeve and you already have your A5 binder, mine has six holes so usually the bcw only has three holes and we cut off a hole so we have to add in all those holes so if it's your first time you can line it up you know using the slots already available to you or if you want to just create your whole new slots and then poke through into the little plastic part the plastic sleeves and then it'll have little perforations from where you can punch your holes. You see those little markings? But because I already have mine made, I'm just gonna line them up like this. And I usually use the BCW sign logo as whether they're lined up or not. And then make sure the side is lined up as well. Or you can use the holes from the sleeves to make sure yours are lined up. And you can use a hole puncher. I got my hole puncher from Amazon. So, or you can go to Michael's or anywhere and get these. Boom, just like that, you have a new sleeve. So I can put this one in the back and I can put this one back. All right, now we can close this. Yeah, okay, so that's how you do the four pocket sleeves, basically. So now that we've done that, I can move 10 back here. We'll do the super M after wavy stuff. And yeah, we can add Hendry in. So this is from Take Over the Moon. And then this is his circle card. And I also have Hendry's Take Off album circle card. But it's on the way. Oh, I did forget I do have this Taehyun I need to put in as well. I've already traded my pools from um, this album from the Dream Chapter magic so i'm just gonna put in taeyun for now until i do find a trade so he's in a safe home um and i'll put him here it's the only spot i have but i do want to trade him for byungyu hanin kai or yonjun if you have them okay so back to 80s so i'm still missing the song this song is like practically impossible to find but I finally got in all of my trades for the Action to Answer albums. We can put all of these in. I'm so happy to have my babies. And if you guys watched my unboxing for um, for these albums, or I mean, I'm sorry, if you watched my K-pop haul for January, yeah, I had i did a trade for jongo to a yosong pc and it turned out that the pc looked different than my other pcs it just looked very different i'm not sure why the way it was laminated it also had different like it had writing on the back of the laminate like however it was made um but the tradee told me that like that's the yosong that she pulled from her um, MMT pre-ordered album and she doesn't know what's up so she ended up buying the Jong Ho that I traded her and I sent her back her Yo song so then she can trade or sell it to somebody else but I was like I'm so sorry like you know it's just not the same so yeah I believe it's this Yo song so he's still not here um, but I do have Son's MMT A version and Yo Song's MTA version to add in. What eggies? I love this one. Oh, they're both doing finger hearts. I just noticed this. <laughs> and then we have 
these versions for the actual album PC for version A and then Yo Songs version A as well. Yay! So cute. I love these pages. So the next thing I have are my PCs for the Map to Answer albums. And these were my pulls. Honestly, such handsome men. I did pull one, one Yo Song, so he will actually be staying in here. Oh my goodness, I'm so sad. My camera cut off. I don't know why. <laughs> but all I did was basically I put in Yo Song. And I have to put in fillers for the other Map to Answer albums. And then I just mentioned that all of these are up for trade for preferably AT, I mean, Son and Yo Song Snap to Answer PCs that I don't have. And if you want to see my wish list, all of my wish list is on my Instagram. So make sure to follow me there. Well, in this part of the video, we're going to be making my Jungkook binder. Um, and we're going to be taking out some of my Jungkook photo cards and just separating him into his own binder because my bts binder has gotten so full to the point where like a lot of things are just not in it because they don't fit in it and when i i don't know if you saw in my the ending of my last uh putting organizing photo card uh video that the slots were just coming out like this is almost past the middle so yeah, we're gonna be redoing that. Um, so I'll just really quickly show you guys my Jungkook binder. So what I did was I got this washi tape at Michael's as well as this binder. It's the same type of binder as my other binder, but it's this pretty rose design like that. And I just put some like sepia toned pictures of Jungkook. I found this fan art online. Um, and I also have Jungkook's Love Yourself to Your Era and Jungkook Working Out and then some just GCF washi tape, you know. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll take this binder and go to where the Jungkook collection starts. So he starts right here in his japan pcs so i'm still gonna keep ot7 together like for all of their album stuff but i will make pull jungkook stuff separately so i think all of these are jungkook right here and dun dun jungkook is in his new binder if i can get it to go in Okay. Well, some of them went in. Guys, so this morning we all woke up to BTS's checklist. I'm so uh, not ready. Well, I am ready, but I'm not ready. Like, I don't know what to expect. You know, we always tell BTS are coming out with new stuff. Even Persona was a whole different vibe than what, you know, they were doing for a while with the Love Yourself series. And so with this new album, especially with, you know, intro, shadow, and outro, ego sounding so different, we don't know what it's going to be like. Oh my gosh. Okay, so Jungkook is in here for the most part. That saves up a lot of room already in here. Let me just go through and make sure I don't have any stray Jungkook. No, I'm pretty sure that's it. I took all this stuff out of the binder. I'm going to put it back in... And I have these in the front just because of the way that they are. Like, I don't want these to bend at all, being underneath the other stuff. So, they're in the front of the binder. Maybe if I put all of the OT7 Korean albums in the Jungkook binder, I can have room for, like, all the extra merch goods and stuff like that. Maybe I'll do that. Yeah. I'm gonna get some hate comments. Like, no, that's not how you do it, you ignorant girl. I'm just so I'm sorry. This is the way I'm gonna do it. Yeah? Yeah? No. Yeah? I mean, I really don't have that much jump hook stuff, but like, this stuff takes up a lot of space. 
yeah i'm done with it okay cool and we will put ot7 stuff like i don't mind it because ot7 always comes before junk coat and i'm never gonna have that many junk coat photo cards yeah i think this is beautiful yeah why not you know so we'll organize this binder first and then we can add stuff to the new binder we have these pictures from the winter package in Helsinki and then the little clear picture and we also have the standee which I'm gonna put in here as well I'm sorry if you hear my TV in the background my family's watching it Porters. Okay, can this fit here? I might just put this here for now until I get my other um, photo cards from the 2019 uh, summer pack. I mean, season screenings. Woo, words. Okay, I think what's really important that I want to be adding in here is I do want to be adding in the winter package diaries so we'll add those behind the other winter packages i mean behind the other diaries here so i have taste let's go and order from age i have back night line are you kidding me so i only have to collect young line um which i actually pulled yungi instead of jungkook of course wow are these bigger than the old ones yeah, these are bigger. You see how big this is in comparison? Wow. It's huge compared to the summer packages. I'm not complaining about it. Um, and I traded my Yoongi for this Jungkook. This beautiful lavender Jungkook. And I have Jimin's. The snowman. Um, and when they received theirs, the U.S. Post Service ruined the package like he was torn up he looked awful and i was so upset because like not only is it her she's not receiving her trade in the best condition like it was in awful condition it was torn it was bent it was all sorts of things i couldn't even believe it happened okay and lastly we have Jacob. and so she was I, and i told her you know I'm so sorry about that. Like, if you find another Yoongi, I will help you pay for it. So, she found another Yoongi, and I split it and paid half of it for her. Because not only did I lose the Yoongi that I had, but she lost her Yoongi that she traded for. So, it's, like, not fair. She was super nice, saying it wasn't my fault. And I know a lot of people would have, like, been, like, you know, lost mail or damaged mail. is not their responsibility. To me, I felt like it was my responsibility. <clears throat> so I helped her and made sure she got her trade you know what I mean like you have to do that I don't think there are any set rules to trading I always hated the disclaimer that's like loss or damage mail is not their responsibility like it doesn't have to be but it also could be you know what I mean so we're gonna put these in from the Helsinki Winter package in Helsinki. Oh, that's so odd. We have, because it's like not in age order, but oh, they look so beautiful in these pictures side by side. I love that. Yes, in the back, we'll have Jimin and Macne. I mean, not Macne, but Jungkook and Shuga. Okay, so we're going to be putting these pictures in. We'll start. We'll do it this way. We'll start with um, June, And then we have Yoongi. These don't fit in four pocket sleeves. I already tried. And they don't fit. So there's that. And I put the other ones in here as well. In the backs. So. We have. Oh what am I doing? I like to do age order with leader first, so yeah. Oopsies. Oop, I switched it. 
like that and then we'll move it down and then we'll put Yungi. Yes, I actually still have some extra copies of the winter package. If anybody wasn't able to cop one and they would like one, I have extras. So please feel free to DM me on Instagram or anything like that. I would love to sell you one. We have Taeyang. And lastly, we have baby Yungoki. Oh no. Oh no, I need some more two pocket sleeves, guys. I won't be able to finish this because I don't have two pocket sleeves. I might have to stop this recording and buy some more two pocket sleeves. So we have the drunk hook binder back out and ready for some photo cards. <clears throat> So, we're going to do some of the regular photo cards before we get into postcards and stuff. Because I don't think I have enough four pocket and two pocket sleeves for those just yet. Like I said, I do have the exhibition photos. All, the, all three sets. And then some other miscellaneous postcards. So, but I do have a whole stack of photo cards. So we'll go through and add these. Uh, I think they're pretty much in order. So we have School Love Affair. I don't have any to add here. I did just buy Junk Cooks though on Baiyi. So yes, I'll be doing a Baiyi haul soon. And we have two HYYH part ones to add. We have Jim and Jimin that I got from my last haul from Trades. So we can finally take out this wow and add them in. Beautiful. And then add them in. Yes. They look so good together. And we can add them in with junk cooks here. One more time. Look at this cutie. Yes. Before he's in here. Okay. I have four of those. And now we're at HYYH part two. I do have a Young Forever Hobie that I traded. Yeah, I don't know what I have. I think I have like a sinus infection. It feels awful though. Hobie. Oh. Yep. Uh, so how does everybody feel about Outro Ego? Feel free to leave a comment down below. Yeah, I would love to hear your opinions of Ego versus Shadow. We just all found out that Shadow is going to be interesting. The color looks a little bit different. You see? Just fine. That in interlude Shadow. I think I called it interlude. Excuse me. Interlude Shadow is... 4 minutes and 20 seconds long when the music video is only 3 minutes long. So, we don't have any You Never Walk Alone, Love Yourself Her, no, Love Yourself Her, oh, no. We do have a Yuki from Love Yourself Her E. Looks like this. What is it focusing on? I don't know. So let's add Mr. Yungi in the middle here. Yes. Alright. Love yourself to your Y. I still have no love yourself to your Y. I'm so excited about this one. I have Jin's to add here. This is one of my most complete sets so far. They look so good. I can't believe how far we've come. All I have are J Hope and V left to collect. And the last ones I have are for Map of the Soul Persona. So I have these two. We have Namjoon and Tay. Yep. In we go with Tae Young. And 
another almost complete set as well. Looking good. Okay. So the next thing I have are just Jungkook photo cards. So we'll start from, I think I have them in order from how they'll go in. So this is for the map of the Soul 7. I need to print my fillers out to put them in. Okay, so I have Jungkook's I Need You in Yokohama PC. It's not the Christmas one, is it? No, it's the Yokohama one. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. If I'm wrong, then I'll just replace it. But I mean, move it back to where it should be. But yes, I have that there. And next, I have... Still have a long ways to go for my junk collection. No rush, hunty, you know. We have epilogue on stage. This two of seven. Wow. Look at this cutie. Yep. I hope that during the Map of the Soul tour they have PCs for sale at um, American stadiums because when I went to the MetLife in day two, I don't recall them selling any merch like that. They only sold, as far as I remember, t-shirts. <laughs> I hope they have like the whole merch line. Like American armies will buy it. Please have everything, you know, so that we don't have to buy it online and wait for it forever. So these are actually, if you watch my unboxing, these are fake. Um, I just put them there as fillers, so I know what they're going to look like. But those are fake. These are official. These are actually from a YouTuber here. I didn't realize she was a YouTuber until I was looking up some uh, old BTS. Um, yeah, they're different. The quality of these are not that good, and they're not shiny on the back. They're matte, and these are shiny. Um, despite being in the f top, I mean the sleeve, but they are shiny. So, her name is Corinna, and yeah, she. I saw that she had a YouTube video on here, and I was like, oh, is this the Corinna that I bought from? And I think it is. So I have Jungkook's 8 of 8 from the Japanese tour. After seeing her on YouTube, I was like, okay, I definitely, I already assumed that these were official, but I, then I definitely knew they were because she has been standing for a while. Jungkook's 7 of 8, yeah, her videos date way back, way back. Just added those two eggies there. So the next thing we have. Okay, so I did. I'll move this around this way now. So it's more easy to see. I have this John Cook from the Love Yourself Tour. Four of eight. Yeah, somebody asked me in the comments of one of my last videos if the speak yourself merch was sold at the stadiums but i don't think they were as far as i can remember i don't think they were and then we have love yourself speak yourself in japan yes miss. so i did order three copies of those i was able to pull two junk hooks um i had one duplicate set out of the three sets so i have three of eight and eight of eight to add so we can take out this guy and the way i have the concert mini pcs uh set up in the binder is by um uh, by day of the concert if that makes sense so the love yourself speak yourself tour in japan was before the final pc so that's why you know it's like that and then i need to add another set to for my group set i guess i'll put this in my BTS binder though, not in my John Cook binder. And this is the Love Yourself Speak Yourself final. And I got one of eight and five of eight. Oops, from the set that I got. So I do have extras of these for sale. I have two through four of eight and then six through eight of eight. I have all of those for sale. Basically all of these I have duplicates of. So please, please hit me up if you want to trade for anything in my binder that I don't have. I would love to trade. Wow, that is beautiful. So this is what a complete set looks like. I mean, it cost me money, but I'm not upset about it. It looks so good. This set is like very Dionysus era. I love his curly hair. 
and his serious look. He looks so masculine in these pictures. When in some older, like, Love Yourself tour pictures, he looks more like an eggy, you know? Oh. So, I love this picture set. He looks so good. The only problem I have is sometimes it's hard to differentiate because the backgrounds all look the same. So, a lot of these pictures are very hard to tell if, like, you don't know. So, the next one I have are the photo sets, which I did just get another jump cook photo set, which I'm excited to add. I still have my all of my HYYH um, group PC here. So, we're at the fifth muster, and I have this single junk cook from the fifth master two of eight his cards are so hard to come by yeah but somebody had one to trade so let's see i have one to add i don't know how long it'll take me to complete the set i don't know why this set is so hard to come by and i do need to add something here we're going to be adding a six pocket sleeve so we can add in for the Korean master the guest book photo cards. So I have one, four, and three. So we're gonna be skipping the first slot. It's just what I do. I don't know why. In case I want to add fillers or anything. We have one of five. These are very tight fit, but it'll work. Three of five. Udi Eggy. And four of five. Yay. Cute. Hey, we have the Jungkook goodbye notes from the fifth muster. I think I'm out of nine pocket sleeves, but I'll put it here for now. Um, yeah, because the Mustard Japan merch was the last set that came out. So, we'll put... I think it, the, it said, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye. So, the B would be first, no? <laughs> cute. And cute. I'm obsessed. Yay! Okay, it really wasn't that much that I had to add today. Um, I'm out of a lot of sleeves, so I might come back before I up ever upload this video and make a third part within the same video. Who knows? Yeah, but that's all I can add for now. Um, so if I come back, I come back. If not, I'll go ahead and say if not, this might be the end of the video. So I'm just going to lay everything out. So I set everything back up. If this is the end of the video, it's the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I'm so excited for Map of the Soul 7. Leave a comment down below if you guys have a favorite song. Like, we don't know what they sound like, but if you are anticipating one of the titles. Um, obviously, I'm really excited about the collaboration with Sia. Um, you know, but I will definitely be streaming the official title track and not the digital only. But I love Sia, so I'm excited about that. Um, I'm also really excited about 0 o'clock because for some reason I feel like it has correlation with 4 o'clock, um, you know, and then right after that is the title Moon, so those kind of correlate together, um, and I'm also really excited for Interlude Shadows, four minute long song, like what is going to be happening in that extra minute of song, um, so I think, yeah, those are my favorites so far, I also feel like 0 o'clock is like, gonna be like a ballad but those are just my opinions and oh i do have to add one more thing <laughs> i'm sitting here staring and i look over and i see that my love yourself speak yourself my love yourself speak yourself in japan photo cards are just sitting by themselves so i'm gonna put up namjoon oh yeah these two that I need to add. Six of nine and eight of nine. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And I do collect the group sets if I can. I'm not pressed about it, but if I do buy the whole mini photo card sets and I have them, I'm gonna keep them. Okay, so as I was yeah, what else is there? I'm, I'm excited for We Are Bulletproof Eternal as well, just because 
I like We Are Bulletproof. It's like an anthem type song. Like you listen to it while you're driving and you get all angry. Um, yeah. Shouting We Are Bulletproof. And what else? That's it for me, you know? If I didn't mention something that you were excited about, um, please leave it in the comments down below and let me know why I should be excited about it. Uh, other than that, thanks for watching, guys. Bye!